Hello, my name's Don D. Uh, I'm a user of uh, Serif Web Plus, and you'll find me on the Web Plus forum on the serif.com site. In this tutorial, we're going to do Google Maps 2, uh, a carry on from uh, the first Google Maps tutorial. Uh, we're going to use the same map here. So if we don't double click the map again, and we get the, the markers that we put up. Uh, now, site property, do a little bit of HTML, uh, edit this, this property. Here we click, click action, and we're going to treat this as a um, label, which can contain HTML. Delete this, and I'm going to paste in a little bit of HTML there. Uh, if you can see that, there's an image link at the top here to uh, image on my, which has got to be uploaded to your uh, to the internet anyway, so you can pick it up. And it's got to be the size that it, you want it to be in the uh, Google Maps. And then I've got a font style, color, and the the wording I want as text. If I OK that and come to this map here, if I click this marker, it will show me there so we've got the picture of the of the house uh, this is property one uh, and the address is blah 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 so that's HTML where you can add a photograph and you can also add hyperlinks uh, to the text here as well um, maybe I'll go into that uh, another time So that's okay, get rid of that. Now if we go to, so that's HTML. Uh, what I will do with the HTML code that I've inserted in this uh, Google map, I'm going to be doing a, uh, a written tutorial on this. So I'll, I'll put it on my site so you can copy and paste and adjust it to suit the, 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 vehicle, the um, picture that you're going to use and the text and uh, I'll most probably write up a, about the hyperlinking as well uh, of uh, the HTML. If we go to property 2 and edit so uh, I've moved the uh, my marker now to this position uh, and what we're going to do now is to uh, have a, a click action of a street view of that location of the marker. So what we do here is click street view and I'll just show you something. I'm just going to move this um, to here and it says the street view is not available. So I've clicked back to where it was and there's a street view is available here so what you do now is click street uh, record view and it says there uh, it just gives you instructions right here we are street view and my properties just around the corner here somewhere oh there it is there that's the street view. You can zoom in. There we are. To that. And then record view. And then that's locked now. That will stay there now. So if you click off this, OK. 
up to this map. And if we scroll down, to this other marker, here it is, put that in the center, and I click the marker, it comes up with the street view. Click off, and there we go. Well, that's another little um, few things that you can do with Google Maps. Um, According to the help, you can have as many markers as you like. You cannot, as far as I can make out, change the style of the marker. It's this balloon type. Um, um, see, this one is, is green. And the, f the first one we used is red. So unless they change automatically as you add each one, uh, there's no way of actually changing it. Okay, that's uh, all for Google Maps now. In fact, let's uh, preview this page. Have a quick look. Here we are. There's the first one. And that's got the picture and the text and if we scroll down there we go to this other one and it's got the street view then of course the being street view you can move it around just to view what's around in the area Right, that's it for now, I think. Thanks for looking in, and I'll do another tutorial very shortly. Okay, goodbye.